This is Nurse Bob with KQAK, KQAC. I'm coming to you today from Lemonwood, the beautiful community, and this is the third annual Running of the Ducks. We are having the Lemonwood Duck Derby today. It's a beautiful day, a little windy, but that's okay. These prize-winning ducks ought to not have any problems with that at all. Swimming, or floating. Quack, quack. Okay, where's that duck from? LSU. It's an LSU duck. LSU, it's a winner. And, and who's the owner? Mr. David Yates. And I understand that uh, it's a thoroughbred. Yes, it not, is. Not a thoroughbred. What kind the is it? Thoroughbreds are from high rollers. Oh, that's the high roller area, according to Colleen. But this is an it. underbred or crossbreed. <laughs> crossbreed. <laughs> <laughs> this is oh. a famous duck. That's all I got to say. <laughs> I can see all obstacles in my way. Here we are. Things are really starting to heat up around the duck races here. The crowds are gathering. It just seems to be a mob scene here today. Everybody is just betting on their ducks, and I think I see the Imperial Empress of the Ducks. Excuse me, Your Majesty. Yes. I was just wondering if we might have a word with you a moment for, with the KQAK, KQAK, KQAK. Could you, by chance, tell us, you know, how did all of this get going? You know, I know it's a third annual one, but how did this start? Well, actually, I'm the co-chair of the Lemonwood Beautification Committee. My co-chair is Debbie Bergevin, and this is our third annual Duck Derby, and it's really a fundraiser to raise money for the community and to buy additional trees and plants that we need, and also to build support around the community and meet friends and neighbors and just have a good time. <laughs> And now I have Duck Wrangler, Lee. Okay. He's been with this since the onslaught and onset. Onslaught too. Yeah, in fact, he is the creator of this event. He is the one that had the idea to get these ducks from all over the country and see how they race here at Lemonwood. How do you picture today going, Lee? Today is going to be a terrific day because we got a tailwind and they're going to just zip down the line. You think so? Yeah. You're seeing a lot of zippy ducks today, huh? Zippy ducks. Zip. Once again, this is your roving reporter, Nurse Bob, with KQAK, KQAC. And now I have Deb, who is one of the official photographers and just all around general people here, who seems to know everything about this place. Well, how do you anticipate today's race is going? I don't know. I, I think the wind is going to be a factor. And uh, the way the ducks go into the water, you know, if you're on your right side or left side, the wind can really either take it away or take you right into the rocks. So you really think that the duck master is going to have a hard time keeping those little quackers in the bucket, huh? I, I do. Yeah, I do. Okay. But, uh, you know, we'll see what happens. Sometimes the wind is an advantage, and uh, those ducks are pretty determined. They'll get to the end of the race. Thank you very much. You're welcome. And I have found the duck master. He is the one that handles all of these lovelies at every heat, and he even starts the high roller race. Isn't that a thrill? That's a thrill. Oh, you gotta get your ducks, man. Every morning you wake up dreaming ducks. You're, you're just a duck master all the duck time. Master. Can't wait, can't wait to find 366 one. days a year, right? Right. I know it. Even and leap year. Now, I just wonder, now, you, you've got all those ducks in a bucket for each right. heat and everything. Now, these high strung little quackers, do you have any trouble with them? Maybe jockeying for position yeah, in there just, and everything? I just wring their neck. You wring their neck? Yeah. Do they still make it to the finish line? Yes. It's amazing. I knew that these things were tough. I'm, I'm tough on them. Okay, but you keep Nobody them in line? I keep them in line. You make sure everything's fair? Make sure they're fair. Oh. They're all dumped. They're all dumped. All Equally right. dumped. You heard it from the Duck Master. They're all dumped. This is for the big thing. And they're off 
Been there running, or swimming, or floating. of the beautification committee and this is one of our uh, one of our main fundraisers for the year all this money that we've raised has gone back to the community and I am proud to tell you that we raised eleven hundred dollars today so thank you for being so generous I also want to thank all of the volunteers who helped bucket full of ducks If you go to the golf course and ask for a bucket of ducks, 